ACGC, though, into the front court. They'll drive down to the baseline by Grimsgard. Good defense by Meyer, and they get it back out. And they're going to shoot a three. No good. Good box out by Littmer. Melrose has it and a chance to take a lead in this game. 9-8. to eight, Melrose down one. Littmer into the front court. They run the offense now. On top, Mia Meyer drives by her girl, puts up a shot and scores. So Melrose does have their first lead at 10 to nine. On the drive in the basket by Mia Meyer. You see Melrose got down nine to two right away, but now they lead by one at 10 to nine. Makaya Littmer shooting for the outside and hits a three point basket. A three for Makaya Littmer, 21 to 15. Seems like Melrose hasn't scored in a while. Now they trail by six. They did have a lead. Now a drive, the dish. Whitney Austin got it to Rademacher. Back out now, and Austin has it again. Looks down low. Rademacher trying to make her move. Spins and shoots and scores. Nice post-up move by Ashley Rademacher. That's her first basket. Littmer has one three tonight. Austin has two. Here's a steal by Cassie Klopaki. And a wide open layup. She makes it. Cassie Klopaki with a steal, that's her first basket. So four minutes into the second half, Melrose trailing by four. They were down one at halftime. It's 33 to 29. Littmer has it, she has 11, Th shooting a three, it's good! Kai Littmer knocks down her second three. She has 14 points. Littmer can't drive in, hands it off to Klopaki, puts it on the floor, can't drive in. Now Duffner past the line. Here's a drive by Littmer, off the glass and in again for Micaiah Littmer. She has 18 points. Now Melrose trails by two. Good run for Melrose right now. Right side pass, holding the ball high is Maddie Denton. They go on the block. Lover tries to shoot over Straka. Good defense, she got a piece of it. Straka at six feet tall, blocked the shot. Here comes Littmer back to the baseline, got to the hoop, couldn't score, got it back somehow. Austin taking a three up and banks it in. Whitney Austin with her third three tonight. The bank shot is in. Melrose pulls to within one with seven to go at 42 to 41. And on the outside, Van Beck drives around the screen to Rademacher, a post player. Way out to Klopp Hockey. Looking down low, can't get it to Meyer. Now Klopp Hockey waiting for help. Meyer pops out. Austin with three threes will drive around, getting, stepping to the basket, puts it up and in, it'll count, and she is fouled on the play. And one for Whitney Austin. Against the man-to-man, -man. they drive down lower, here's a running shot, no good, and Rademacher got the rebound, fell down, but it came over to Cassie Klopp Hockey. And Melrose has the ball as Coach Reller says, hang on now, slow it up, run the plays. Austin will eye a three instead, she shoots it, and it goes in good! They set a two, but it's good. And Melrose leads on the basket by Whitney Austin. 47-46. Pass in for Melrose in a tie game. Littmer in the lane, got to the basket, puts it up and in. Melrose leads. A basket for Micaiah Littmer. And it's 50 to 48 Melrose. And Melrose has a five point lead. Should be good enough for a Melrose win. But a pass in still for ACGC. They're going to launch a long one at the buzzer. It's going to be off the rim, no good. The game is over, and Melrose has their first win this season. The final score, 55-50 over ACGC.